When DNA was introduced as a method of identification, it was a huge game changer, and it continues to be to this day. In fact, television crime dramas usually depict DNA as the buzzer beater, coming in at the last minute with all the information needed to crack the case and save the day. But can DNA evidence always fill in the gaps of criminal cases, and fast? Forensics case number five, instant DNA. Television makes it look so easy. A team finds DNA evidence, runs it through a computer, and minutes later, the extensive criminal record and physical description of a suspect magically appears. But as NFSTC forensic biologist Rob O'Brien tells us, DNA analysis has many pieces that need to fall into place, and that doesn't always make finding the bad guy so quick and easy. Well, on television, it's always one person doing the DNA, and they have every instrument at their disposal all ready to go, whereas some processes in the lab alone are three hours. You know, you put it on the instrument and you have to wait three hours. There's nothing you can do to speed that up. And that's just one of the many steps. To do a DNA test for crime scene, it could be done in a few days, like two or three days, but that is under the assumption that the actual the DNA analysts are doing nothing and just waiting for a case to come in, which is never the situation. So cases tend up taking sometimes weeks or months to get processed just because they already have cases that are in front of it that they have to work. And then all the analysts in the lab, they don't all have their own instrumentation because the instrumentation is so expensive, so they're sharing instruments. So as a result of that, they have to basically sign up and wait their turn to use an instrument. So it's not like they can just process it at their leisure or when they want it, they sometimes have to wait. And of course on television everything seems to take a minute to process. So while DNA does help in an investigation, it takes time, needs all the necessary pieces, and they have to all fall into place. It's a delicate process that doesn't produce instant results. While there are new technologies that can process DNA quicker than in the past, like rapid DNA for example, they still take time and most crime laboratories are using traditional instruments. When television dramas break links in that DNA chain for dramatic effect, it's definitely forensics.